Hi, I'm Hilary Duff, and here are some lessons that I hope to pass on to my son. One thing that my mom always said to me when I was little was be yourself because everyone else is taken. I think when you are being yourself wholeheartedly, you feel really full, and I think that's really important and a good message to share with younger people. What's gonna happen? Happen. I think something I've learned as I've gotten older is to trust my instinct more and my intuition has never really failed me. I don't know what it is Luca's going to want to do in his career and his life when he's older and he's making his own decisions, but I really hope that he leans on his instinct and his judgment because usually it doesn't steer you wrong. My biggest hope for Luca when he's dating is that he's a gentleman. Love yourself and you can love others and try not to take it all too seriously because that first feeling of love or dating or heavy like or whatever it is can feel so powerful. So I hope he just keeps his head on his shoulders and he's a good boy. You can't bring me. One of the biggest things that I encourage with him is getting outside and it's not tough for me to convince him. He's a really active kid. You know, it gives us great time together where we're using our imagination and we're being active. I pray that Luca never loses his silly side. You need to have fun and you need to be weird and you need to be silly. It's really freeing and I hope that's a quality that he has forever. I really hope that throughout his life he follows his heart and his passions. And that also walks a very fine line with kind of knowing what you're good at and working hard at perfecting it. And I'm always going to encourage a strong work ethic and for him to work for what he wants. And hopefully that is mixed with him following a true passion that he has. Luca's super into building stuff right now. So he's really into Legos and building like little cities and towns. And he has all these fun like prop foods that I brought him from set when we have fake food. Um, the prop guy will give them to me so they have like really realistic looking like sushi and like ramen bowls and really intense fake food and he loves to uh, serve it to me so maybe he'll be a chef. The possibilities are, are endless for someone his age and I'm just really excited to see who he will become. He's going to school now so he, every day I hear new stories about friends or things that happened on the playground and for the most part it's all really positive. But you can kind of see how being around other kids for so much of the day is starting to like change him or affect him or he'll pick up a nuance or a, like a, a habit or something. And it's, a, it's pretty positive and all awesome. And at the same time, I'm constantly reminding him who he is or trying to explain how he can better navigate some kind of situation. So I think that I always hope to be a safe place for him to come and talk to me and share his feelings. He's so sensitive and I think that's a great quality for a boy to have.